Hey friends, Miranda here. Today I have a Walmart grocery haul for you guys. I spent $195, went in to grab a few things that we needed and obviously came out with more than what was intended. But you know, that always happens. So it's just nice to have easy access to a bunch of things. So um, this should definitely hold us over for the next two, maybe three weeks. So we are good to go, you guys. Let's go ahead and see what I picked up. I did go ahead and pick up a package of the peas and carrots. I always like to have these on hand. I mostly just use um, in my seafood salad or sometimes I will use for like a tuna salad or, or my rice. Um, I did get a thing of cream cheese and then a thing of the little applesauce pouches. My oldest girl, she's actually really been into these. She's the only one that likes them. So I just went ahead and picked up a little box for her. I did get a package of the Fiesta blend shredded cheese. And then Amy, I found it. So my girl Amy over at A Girl Being Frugal, she posted this. I forget if it was on Instagram or Facebook, but whatever's. Circus cookie ice cream you guys so this is like those little cookies that I grew up eating the little uh, like animal cookies that are like pink and white frosted with the sprinkles you can see there's like pieces of the cookies in the ice cream so I am so excited to try this you guys you have no idea so I was so happy to find that thank you Amy for the heads up on that um, I did get a 12 count of this rice pudding. It's the Cozy Shack brand. Um, they're like more snack size cups. They're not like, you know, kind of like the more individual, I guess you could say. Um, and then I did get the kiddos some Pop-Tarts. I saw these and I like immediately had to get these. My kids have been obsessed with SpongeBob for years. Um, this is like the most annoying show ever, you guys. But um, yeah, they're huge SpongeBob fans. So this is the Seaberry. But I thought it was pretty cute because it has like the little um, different designs on it. So why not? Got those for them. And then some coffee creamer. This is such an awesome flavor, you guys. If you have not had it, definitely try it. Coconut cream. So they did not have my ravioli, but they did have this uh, cheese tortellini. Um, so I went ahead and picked up two bags. I didn't think one would be enough for my family of six. Um, so I'm excited to try that. I'm sure it's going to be just as good as the ravioli. Um, then I got a 32 count of the Great Value Little Fruit Snacks. These are actually really good, you guys. They have the regular flavors. It's like strawberry, orange, and some other ones. But I like this one the best. They're all good, but I like this one, the more like tropical, tangy flavors, whatever. Um, then you got some Vermont maple sausage links. I did pick up three packs. I hadn't bought any in a while and I didn't have any sausage in the freezer. So I wanted to go ahead and have some of those on hand. And then I got the bacon, egg and cheese croissant sandwiches. These are actually really good for being great value brand. They have some really yummy uh, little breakfast sandwiches. I was craving some Twizzlers, so I went ahead and picked up those. I did get a, I believe it's a three pound bag of apples. And then I did also get the kiddos, their mini uh, bagels here. I like sandwiches on them or just cream cheese. These, you guys, oh my gosh, you have no idea. So for years, years, you guys, I'm telling you. So a long, long time ago, I found some Cheetos. I, I don't remember what design they were, but they were the cinnamon ones. They're like cinnamon and sugar. They were so bomb, and I have not been able to find them ever since until today. Um, I don't care if they're like the small bags, but they are the cinnamon ones, and they are shaped like eggs, so I thought that was so cool. They're called them Sweetos. These are so bomb if you've never had them. Um, I, I saw these in the checkout line, so I didn't have a chance to go and actually see if at Walmart they have like a big bag of these. Um, but I did go ahead and pick up three bags of these. It's going to be my little sweet treat just for me. You have no idea how excited I am, you guys. No idea. Then I did go ahead and get a thing of the French bread. It's already sliced, so I like that. It's perfect for when we do like a pasta night or something. Just add some butter and some like garlic salt on there and you're good to go. Then you guys, I was like pretty happy to find these. I, You know, it's just a nice little sweet treat for the kiddos, some marshmallows. So they had the Disney Frozen. They're shaped like little, I don't know what the purple ones are supposed to be, but the blue are obviously like snowflakes. And then these, you guys, Lucky Charms. These are new, like I've never seen these anywhere else. That's kind of the cool thing about Walmart is that sometimes they get in certain items that you can't find at any other like 
other stores. So, um, but they are shaped like the little marshmallows in the Lucky Charms here. You got like hearts and stars and clovers and all that. So thought that was pretty cool. I did pick up a few cherry pies here. These little pies are really, really good, you guys. They're only 50 cents, so that's an awesome deal. I did pick up a couple of my Mega Bowls, my two favorites. The Country Fried Chicken has become a new favorite of mine. But of course, my all-time favorite, bomb.com, buffalo style mac and cheese. Yes, please. And then you guys, I know I'd seen um, someone said these were at Dollar Tree. I found them and obviously for less than what they go for at Dollar Tree. Um, but yeah, I picked up several packs of them, like four. But they're the fudge brownie M&Ms. And I am so stoked to try these, you guys. You have no idea. So I picked up some. I'm going to share some with some friends. So... I got those, and then I did go ahead and pick up a thing of popcorn chicken. It was nice that they had that. I've actually been really wanting some popcorn chicken. And then I picked up a thing of these breaded boneless chicken wings. I've never gotten these before, but I figured this would be easy for like, maybe we do like a pizza night, have these on the side, and like I have like plenty of like different sauces and whatnot that I could use to toss them in. So I got those. Then I also got some cinnamon French toast bites as well as some of the little mini pancakes just for some breakfast options for the kiddos. That way they're not just getting bored of like cereal and whatnot. Um, I did get a couple cans of whole kernel corn and then I got four cans of the petite diced tomato because I was completely out and I like to have these on hand for like when I do soups or you know whatever that kind of stuff. So I did also get a thing of vegetable oil and then this stuff you guys. This is really good. This is the chicken dipping sauce. It honestly tastes like honey mustard to me, but it is really good, you guys. If you haven't tried it, definitely pick it up. Try it out. I did get a few onions here. Um, they did not have my ragu Alfredo sauce, so I went ahead and picked up the Great Value. I think I got this once before. It was pretty good. So I got that to put on the tortellini that I got. Olive Garden sauce here, you guys, the dressing. Um, again, I'm gonna be making that amazing chicken. If you guys haven't checked out the recipe, I'll leave it linked in the description box below, but it was a huge hit with my family. So it's gonna be one of those things that's a go-to meal probably at least a couple times a month, so. Um, I picked up several cans of tomato sauce. I like to have these also for like soups, um, just kind of as like a base or when I make my rice. And then I did also pick up a thing of a sloppy joe mix, man which I want to do those one of these days. So we needed some snacks, you guys. So I went ahead and picked up this uh, snack pack here. It's 18 counts, so you get two flavors of Bugles, two flavors of Chex Mix, and then the Gardettos. And then I did also go ahead and actually pick up um, this right here. It's the Cheeto pack. I don't know why, but I've really been loving Cheetos lately, and they've like never really been one of my favorite chips to go to but I've been loving them so you got the crunchy you got the puffs and then you got the cool ranch and the nacho cheese Doritos in there of course I had to I was so happy they had some in stock my black cherry clear American I'm almost regretting not picking up the other uh, pack that they had because they only had two packs there you do get 12 in here but oh my gosh you guys this is my absolute fave and it's been forever since I've been to Walmart actually um, so like I said I probably should have picked up the other one too because I don't know when I will be going back um, I did get the kids the 32 count of the Yoohoo chocolate drink they love these and this is the only place I've ever been able to find it is at Walmart same as the 40 pack of the high C you get four flavors in there you get the uh, fruit punch orange Tropical Punch and Strawberry. Um, it's a good deal. Again, kiddos love it. Um, I did pick up a eight count of the orange flavored Powerade, a six count of these little Coca-Colas, then got a 36 count of eggs, two packs of tortillas, this big old thing of chicken leg quarters. It was only like six bucks, you guys, but honestly, I think it's a really good deal, and there's just so much you can use this for. Um, so... It's always good to have chicken on hand. Um, I got my kids their little drink thingies. They absolutely love them, you guys. Like, I cannot, like, rave to you enough of how much they love those. Um, then I did get a couple things of ground beef. And then I have not gotten my Chobanis in forever, so I'm excited to have some on hand. So I did pick up several flavors, you guys. They're my absolute favorite yogurts. So I got the Coffee Brownie Bliss and the Apple Crisp. Um, we got the peanut butter dream, the cinnamon fun, or cinnamon bun fun, and the coconut snowball. 
Something else I haven't had in forever, you guys. Chicken pot pie and beef pot pie. Those are the only two flavors they had. I was kind of hoping for turkey, but that's okay. Um, it's Like I said, it's been forever since I've had them, but they're so good. Um, and then the two main, like fries that i buy from there which is honestly a good deal they're both two pound bags and they're already seasoned they're so delicious you guys like if you've never picked these up get you some the deli style wedges and then these ones the batter mix seasoned french fried potatoes they are so delicious you guys for what they are like being you know fries frozen fries these are so good um then i picked up a couple of the honey butter uh pillsbury biscuits here they are the flaky ones so good you guys so good um and then i remember seeing someone haul this now they have like different flavors like they're seasoned differently but i wanted to go ahead and try one of these and it's a pork loin filet and this one is um seasoned with asiago peppercorn i guess but it just looks really good so i went ahead and i got that one um and then we also got some limes the best ranch ever and last but not least actually this is not the last item um so i got some cottage cheese because i want to eat some of that with fruit i did get a bunch of bananas and lastly a couple gallons of milk so that's everything that i picked up this time around at walmart you guys hopefully you guys can find some of these things at your local walmart Thank you so, so much for watching. Join the family if you have not, and I will see you in my next video, you guys. Bye.